let's do this naturally my first video of the year has to come from Macari you guys know that I am absolutely in love with the brand I love Macari it's my main skincare so today I am going to showcase two of your Macari products I'm gonna compare them so that you know which one is perfect for your skin type and obviously the ones that will be good for what you're trying to achieve before we get into the video, please could I ask you to subscribe to my channel if you haven't done so and share this video because I think other people might benefit from it as well. Please give me a thumbs up and also leave your comments in the comment section below. If you don't wish to talk about your skin publicly and you want to talk to me privately, come to me on Instagram, slide in my DM. My Instagram handle is TV. Uh, talk to me about anything send your pictures and I can help you because I've used the Macari quite a lot and I do know how to use the Macari products I'm in a position to help you okay so let's get into it I'm gonna be comparing the sandalwood butter and the velvet rose both of these products are from the Macari's new advanced intense range so if you're wondering which one is suitable for your skin or if you've tried one and it didn't quite work well for you by the time I finish this video you will know which one is suitable for you so these two products are actually different but there are many similarities this is why some people don't know the difference okay the similarities are that these two products would actually help to firm your skin would also help to eliminate the appearance of stretch marks and cellulites cellulite in particular because that's where I saw a lot of results because I've used both okay but they are different as well so the first one I would like to talk about is the sandalwood butter so sandalwood obviously came out after the velvet rose um, I don't know why I picked it up first but it was in my hand so I decided to talk about it first so the sandalwood it's got um, organic chlorine I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly now that organic chlorine is um, is a blend of natural ingredients that lightens the skin so it is in this product and this also has a uh, shea butter and cocoa butter in it and the reason why they've put that there obviously is to keep the skin very moisturized it also has ascorbic acid which is vitamin c in this product okay i'm sure there are many more but these are the main ones that i want to list out to you guys now once a macari product has organic chlorine and this is this is based on my own experience with Macari. That product is to lighten your skin as well. So basically, sandalwood is made for firming your skin. But it is also for lightening your skin, okay? So if you want to, if some of you who have been using uh, lightening products already on your skin, and then you and then you switch to velvet rays for example because you wanted to also firm your skin and then you realize that your skin is getting darker it is simply because velvet rose although it could lighten your skin however if your skin is already going through a lightening treatment and you stop using what you're using to use velvet rose it means that your shade would also drop which makes you darker does that make sense Okay, so basically, if you prefer to keep your skin light and you also want a firming lotion, I would recommend the sandalwood. Don't use the velvet rose, use the sandalwood. So what skin type is the sandalwood suitable for? If you have a sensitive skin, I would advise you to be very, very careful using this product. So for dry skin, you can use it. Normal skin, you can use it. Another thing that you need to add to your skincare routine if you're using this product is exfoliating please exfoliate your body daily not to scrub too hard you can use a sponge to you know make sure that you scrub if you're using a skin lightening product for example always always exfoliate okay make sure that you scrub your thighs um your balm your hand or your tummy wherever that you're concentrating this product on make sure that you exfoliate these parts of your body okay um you can use body scrubs if you want to but i always get like a sponge and gently exfoliate every single day it does help um it does help this product to work really really well and then exfoliate helps with the blood circulation then bam with this your skin and your body will thank you okay so that's sandalwood to recap very quickly on sandalwood if you have a sensitive skin use this three times per week if you want to use it every day that's entirely up to you as long as your body is not reacting to it 
then that's fine if you live in a tropical country i would say please apply your sun protection when you're out and about if you put this product on your skin and you're not wearing a sunscreen when you're out and about it's counterproductive your skin will go darker sun damage is real okay so that's sandalwood i really like it it smells absolutely gorgeous it's got like that cocoa buttery smell it's just so beautiful if you want to buy it and you're okay with all the things i've said about it then you can go ahead and purchase it it's a really good product macari has done well on this you can get 15 percent discount if you use my code jane15 make sure you buy online to be able to use my code okay viva rose is such a beautiful product i really really like it, it contains um guanara it contains rose hip oil it contains pomegranate and it also has glycolic acid and more in here this is basically like the blue crystal of the range anybody can use this product so if you're one of these people who love your melanin it's popping and you just love your skin tone the way it is but you want it to glow and also you want to achieve the firmness on your skin Velvet Rose is your girl. You can use Velvet Rose every single day. It smells absolutely gorgeous. I really, really like it. I'm one of those people who really appreciate rose smell. I have like a rose scented candles in my bedroom and I burn it and I use rose water as well. So I'm a big fan of rose smell. Again, this has collagen in it firming diminishing stretch marks being you super moisturized and glowy i really really like it it's very simple the glycolic acid in it is not overpowering otherwise i would have felt it it's really good um if you have a sensitive skin this is actually perfect for you i use it every day and you can too it's really really good again because i'm so obsessed with moisturizing my skin the moisture in this is not enough for my skin so i always add the glycerin to seal my skin i want to wake up in the morning with my skin really moisturized or even when i'm out and about in the day i want to come back home in the evening and my skin is staying or moisturized especially when i wear like tight jeans leggings um, or gym wear sometimes they dry out your skin um, but when i use this and use the glycerin as well my skin stays moisturized at the end of the day you can use the macari glycerin or you can buy a body oil i sometimes use ordinary body oil so yeah very rose is just so nice so i know this question will come up so i'm gonna go ahead and answer it now which of these is the best the answer to that question is it depends on what you want to achieve so this is the sandalwood and i'm recapping now if you want to maintain your skin lightening or you're hoping to achieve skin lightening sandalwood is best for you very rose will firm your skin but it won't lighten your skin. If you're already lightening your skin and then you stop to use Velvet Rose, your skin will darken a little bit. So if you're lightening your skin, go for Sandalwood. If you have a sensitive skin, you can use both, but this one you can only use three times per week. So that makes Velvet Rose better for you if you have a sensitive skin because you can use it without any worries. And if you're hoping to keep your melanin popping you want to keep your skin firm if god has blessed you with a uniform skin tone you don't need to lighting or any of that then velvet rose is perfect for you because all you have to do is firm your skin keep it supple keep it tight keep it beautiful however this will brighten your skin a little bit and give you a glow but it's not like lightening your skin people are not gonna go oh my goodness did you lighten your skin they will never say that but people might say your skin looks really glowy and beautiful so that's the difference between the velvet rose and the sandalwood so that's all i've got today for velvet rose and sandalwood butter i decided to make the video together because there's no point making them separately if you wish to buy these from macari website you already know what my code is it's jane15 you can go ahead and get one for yourself if you want to talk more about these products please come and find me on instagram i've used them for a while so i know i know them very well i hope you've enjoyed my video and in which case please give me a thumbs up share this video with your friends your family even your haters okay i shall see you again very soon love you a lot Mwah.